Hey guys, Liquid here, and welcome back to Let's Play The Walking Dead Blind, where last left off. We were, um, we were stuck in that house where we were, uh, and with, blah, 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 blah. we were stuck in that house because of all the zombies. We had rendezvoused with Omid and Krista. We, we learned that Vernon took our boat, and now we're just trying to, trying to escape and find Clementine and get to safety, but, uh, get it. It's all a bit uh, hazy for us all now because uh, some people think we should. Kenny and I think we should continue looking for a boat. They all think that we should find some town or something. But, but we're about to escape now. No walkers. Things are looking up. So it's a, a miracle that they they didn't find that. Uh, Keep a goddamn eye out. They didn't hear that that banging. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well... Oh man, so this must be the uh... I guess this was the... The good couple... That owned the place. cared about us I forgive her but it don't make it any less wrong. I feel you Kenny you don't just end it because it's hard you stick it out and you help the folks you care about so let's figure a way out of here and get that little girl we should move let's roll got at least one shot left let's clear the room before we move on Lee figure out where we're headed so I'm guessing, like, because these people were, I guess, I'm assuming that these people were humans when they died. Even though they look re really zombified. I guess because they died by a shot in the head, they did not turn into the infected. Lee, you okay? Yeah. Let's keep at it. What do you call this thing? It's like a mirror? Art? Duh. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. I wonder with them what the what the story was with like their son who was upstairs. I wonder. Like, did they put him up there, or did he, get, like, go there on his own? Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. Well, I'm sure there's anything... here. Better not going out this window. I'm just getting flashbacks now to Duck. And it's real, it's real sad. But that was a big doozy. Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. We're gonna make another jump? Oh, I guess or we're gonna... Oh, well, I guess we are. But my prediction is someone's not going to make it. Oh, okay then. And Kenny, Kenny, come on, Kenny. Oh, please, Kenny, make it. Oh, okay then. I guess I was... It seemed like a good moment to kill someone off there. Yet, 
It's good to be moving. You're doing good. I'm not, but I'm trying, man. What happened? Honestly, you know how many nights Cat and I laid in that broke-down RV? And she'd give me hell for not thinking enough about the rest of you. All of them. Every damn night. You got that walkie-talkie? Yeah, of course I do. You might want to give him a call and tell him we're coming for him. Yeah, right. Careful crossing. We need the elements of surprise. It almost seemed peaceful viewed from afar. River Street's just up ahead. Nope. Maw of darkness full of walkers? Fuck that shit. Um. I don't see any down there. You can hear them, right? We're all desensitized to it, but I can still smell them. Let's keep going, you bunch of lollygaggers. <clears throat> oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. We have to get it back. We have to get it back. That's our lifeline. You, you can like, we like suspend me by my knees or something. If we don't, we need every clue that comes out of it. Lee's right. I am so fucking sorry. It's fine. We just need to figure out who's going down there. No, we don't. Oh. Krista. Jesus fucking Christ. I got it. Get me up. Fuck. We can't reach. Find something fast. Yeah, I'll, I'll try to find a pole, a ladder, or something. A ladder would be too easy, but I imagine like there might be like a pole. Or we do have this knife. We could try to get her by the. Oh, here we are. A pole. What do you know? Grab onto this. We'll pull you up. Good. Thanks. Make me use my only arm. Oh, fail. I'm not sure if I failed that or... What? Uh-oh. Oh, man. Oh, Krista, you want... you? Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up here, get up here. Get the Fuck. pole. Jump up here, baby. Let's go. Jump. <sighs> oh no. This can't be. Fucking mouth. Look, Kenny, what are you doing? Yeah, what the what heck are you, are you doing? doing? Yeah, get her, Ken. Said all that shit oh wait, is Kenny sacrificing now. himself? Come on, reach. I got you, hun. Save her. Go, go, go. Can you fucking hear me? Oh gosh. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get Kenny. Oh, where are you? You gotta run, man. Go. We'll find a way to get you. Oh, gosh. Hopefully, this isn't a truck situation. Kenny. We're going in after him. We can't. We have to. Lee. Go. Is that it? Where? Where'd he go? Maybe he ran. Maybe. Maybe he ran. Maybe, maybe the man's all right. You'll find us. What if he doesn't? He went down there for you. I know he did. He... He was a brave man. Wherever he is.
Well, that's... I didn't expect that. You're a brave man, Kenny. I really hope he's alive. Ooh, the Marsh House. As soon as someone dies, they don't immediately have to have their sins forgiven. Well, it gets an hour moratorium at least. I understand. This is a shitty time. But I want to make sure we're clear before we go forward. What is it? Clementine, I know Kenny was your guy. Yeah? When it comes to Clementine. Well... Guys would be great for her. Keep her safe. We do our best. You know that. Good. Thanks. Whatever your best is, I'll trust it. Yeah, they laid me. That's all you can do. She'd be a, a good daughter for anyone. Well, at least it doesn't look like a death trap. They, they seem to be. They they'd be good prep parents. Going first. You're the lightest. Yeah, I doubt her parents are alive down there, man. Now or never. All or nothing. We're coming, Clementine. You gotta go the safe way. Go nice and slow. Uh, sounds like it's buckling. Uh, what I probably try to do is like maybe like keep. Like, put one leg on one side, the other leg on the other side, kind of like, crossing. scoot along it. Like, that seems like to be the safest way. Oh, that's not good. Oh, fuck. Shit. Are you okay? Can't catch a break. I'm kind of fucked here. What are you gonna do? I'll figure something out. There's not a ton of options. Fuck it. I'm going for it. Going for it? What does that mean? You heard me. It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? <laughs> but maybe you got to it fast enough. Maybe you'll be fine. I can't risk losing more time on a long shot. Um. Find a boat. We'll meet north of town. A boat? We still have to get out of the city. I'll get Clementine and meet you. What if? Don't what if? Fulfill Kenny's wishes. You. Wishes. Right. So this is. I'm gonna assume that this is. Blah, blah, blah. This is just gonna be like a charge. My name is Lee Everett. This is my story. We're coming, Clementine. Don't you wait. Oh. thousand zombie bites can't shatter the resolve of hard persevering friendship oh 
I gotta imagine, like, getting, getting your, like, body covered with, a uh, Walker blood like that, it can't be good. Like, surely that's, like, the same as getting bitten and having their blood get, get into you. I'm thinking, okay, I'll keep recording. It's quiet. Too quiet. Seriously, it, it actually is pretty, like, too quiet because there should be something in here. Hear anything, Lee? Hmm, some sort of tripwire? Looks like if you, if you automatically open that. Oh! Okay, we do not. Adjoining rooms. Hello. Okay. This is Sybil. You look horrible. And you're missing an arm. Y yes, I am. Go over there. Put your things down. Right, we'll, uh, we'll s see more about the encounter of Lee and this one, and this fella next time on Let's Play The Walking Dead. I'm the Good Solidus 9000. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And, uh, until next time, liquid out!